Let's start this a little different. Ooh. Is this thing on? Ooh. And now, to the millions and millions of listeners and viewers all across the world. Let's go. It's the That's Not Christian Podcast. Let's go. What up, baby? We here. So, wow. I, guess, I guess this is a good topic right here. Uh, CHH was really uh, Twitter. I mean, I'm not even a Twitter head like that. Were you guys on Twitter? Did you guys see any of the, the tweets that were going around? Uh, oh, so, uh, are we addressing the elephant in the room right now? Because we, we, got, we, we got a guest coming up, right? Are we really going to get huh? into it right now? <laughs> yeah, let's get into it, man. You know what I'm saying? Right. Okay. Um, okay. Well, 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 let's, let's do it then. Well, let's, let's backtrack. Uh, we released the episode. Um, that episode was basically talking about a CHH artist, Joey right. Vantes. And uh, we had mentioned, a sh- well, obviously it became a topic for us because we were right. mentioning the whole game situation, right? Like that's, right. that's pretty, that's pretty out the norm. Well, 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 well let, me, let, let, let me back up. The reason why we did the story, first of all, the reason why we did the story, I'm in a, I'm in a chat with it, with it. Well, now we're in a chat with a bunch of CHH artists. Uh, crew dropped the link to the game's uh shout out for Joey, right? That's how I found out about it. I before that, Joey wasn't on my radar, you know what I'm saying? I don't listen to his music, it's not it's not my wave, you know what I'm saying? No, this no, this to the dude, you know what I'm saying? I just it's just not my wave, you know what I mean? Um, a lot of people think he's very talented. Um, I believe him, it's just you know, I, I just you know, some, some, some just, it's just not the type of music that I listen to. I, yo, I listen it's to It's not country. Mob Deep. It's not Wu-Tang. It's not, my, it's not, it, it's not Griselda. You know what I'm saying? Like Griselda. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, not enough gunshots in your music. Not, right? not enough. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, I listen to country music too. A lot of people don't like country music. You know what I'm saying? So like, it's no diss to him. It's just, it's just not my way. Yeah, um, yeah. But so he wasn't on my radar. But when I saw that joint, it's just, look, first of all, I'm a, I'm a marketer. Right. I'm a marketer. I do I do social media marketing for brands. I run accounts for for brands. I consult for brands. I coach. I do all of that. Right. So I'm in this world and I'm working with a tech. I'm working with a tech company and um, Cameo comes up. Right. They want to use Cameo because they want to use influencer marketing because they want to uh, grow their brand. And jokingly, one of the guys said the game. Right. They were joking. Right. And so that's why when he when when crew dropped the uh, the link to to that uh, to that Instagram video, I was like, oh, that's interesting. You know, boom. And I dropped the link. And that's how that's kind of like how the crew. I, well, I don't know. I, honestly, I don't know if, if crew knew about it before. I don't know if Jay knew about it beforehand. But the, I, that's when I dropped the the uh, the link to Cameo. And that's when I dropped the link to you And was like, yo, let's discuss this. Right. Oh, so it was your fault. <laughs> nah. Well, not really. Well, fault. Define I'm fault. Just, I'm, I'm just joking. Right? No, no, absolutely. But it was you all because, behind this the whole time. Because, huh? <laughs> because what what did we? First of all, what did we say? We didn't say anything about. We didn't. We didn't say that the man used cameo. We never made that accusation, right? We didn't. No, nope. we never. We never said that throughout the you podcast. Said, I, I specifically I said assuming right that he's using that platform because we don't know. They could have he could have an agent who knows his agent, right. or they could be friends, right. like we mentioned in the podcast. Right, mm-hmm. absolutely, yeah, absolutely. Mm-hmm. And, and so, and so that's why that's why we did the podcast episode, but never in the podcast that we say that that's what he did, right? Yeah. Um, and that's kind of you know fast forward. Um, we do the podcast episode, right? Um, and uh, and this joint just it goes viral. Right. We got we got a couple of videos that, that are our top videos. Uh, Dana Chanel is like one of the top ones. And and now congratulations to, to Joey, because listen. We definitely deserve a shout out because we, we help promote this man's single. Right. We never <laughs> we never besmirched his character. Never. We never. We, we never falsely accused him of anything. You know what I'm saying? Um. I feel vindicated, man. You know what I'm saying? Because in this video that he dropped recently, 
uh, he admits to doing all the things that. Wait, hold on. Because before okay. we get into that. All right. All right. Go ahead. Go let's, ahead. Let's, let's give. Because not maybe not everybody knows. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. So we dropped the video, right? Mm -hmm. What is it? Two days later, right? Um, We get a cease and desist letter. Is it two days later or the same day? Two days later. We got it on Friday. We become <laughs> the fastest growing cease and desist podcast. Oh, man. yeah. In the world. Just blank this dude. This dude. Yo, Yo, somebody turn off this, this camera. <laughs> okay. We became the cease and desist podcast. You feel me? It's not TNC, but C and D. Exactly. So, so we get a cease and desist letter. Uh, Basically, hey, saying that and mind we, you, and from mind Watson, you, and mind you, they didn't even spell our name right. Hey, hold on, hold on, hold on. Shout out, shout out to the new show sponsor, WatsonVantes.com. Yeah, you, know I mean? <laughs> you can get your cease and desist merch. Yeah, you know I mean, no cap. <laughs> There's no go cap. To, go to no, Watson, WatsonVantes.com. Check out the merch. You know what I mean, and and, and support what, us. What, what's that promo code? What's that promo code? Promo code TNC twenty to get twenty percent off. Let's go. <laughs> Limited time only. So Let's so go. we basically get this cease and desist letter. And when I get it, right, or when, when it was dropped or given to me, because it's four of us, right? Like we all right. run different right. accounts. We all check emails, check uh, Spotify, YouTube, whatever. You know what I'm saying? So when, when, I, when I see it, I was kind of like- The team oh. is the team, right? Yeah. I was, I was kind of like, okay, somebody is offended. Joking with us? Oh, yeah. Who saw it first? Who saw it first? I did. Jay did. Jay saw the email. So when I when I saw it, I was like, "Well, somebody's offended." And I also said, "Well, maybe, maybe out of respect, maybe we might want to take down that video, not because legally we felt any kind of threat at all, right. because when right. we read the 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 actual whole thing, we were like, okay, this is like got it got grammatical errors, right? And that was that was something that we discussed in the chat too. Was like, yo, this is this is fake. First of all, like it's got typos." You know what I mean? The 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 link, the domain to the domain doesn't work. The link to the domain, you know what I'm saying? The email address doesn't work. Right. It takes you to a Squarespace. And 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 Jay from the crew highlighted that in his video. You know what I mean? Right. I was like, yo, this joint is fake. And on top of that, we didn't say nothing about this man. We didn't accuse him of anything. We didn't lie about him. We didn't slander him in any type of way. You know what I'm saying? Like right. Right. the video staying up. And we went back and forth about this, right? Yeah. So um, with the cease and desist, right? Because I want to really want to focus on that. You know, it was like an option of okay, maybe we might have offended our, our, you know, a brother in the Lord or something like that, right? right? Right. But then it also felt like to me it was like a form of like, I don't know, like kind of bullying or right, like, right. or like censorship, where it's like, right. oh, we're gonna call the lawyers on you, or or you know what right. I'm saying? And then that right. was like, that's kind of whack. Like I'm not feeling that that. You know, you well, first of all, first of all, in other like, words, it's, what it's does the corny. Bible say? What is the corny. right? Like, like Ann said, it's corny, right? Right, yeah. And, but what does the Bible say, right? It, it says that you're supposed to take it right to, to, the, to, to the church, right? Right, take it to your brother, take it to the church. You know, the Bible says that we're going to be judging angels, you know what I'm saying? Right. Like fallen right. angels. So, you know, we should be able to judge situations and and, 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 and accountability and stuff right. like that, you know what right. I'm saying? So and we I, and we were we were definitely accountable too because we took it to several people and like yo what you think about this you know right Should we take it down was were we wrong you know whatever whatever and a lot of people were like nah there's nothing wrong with this you know if right if, if yes, he was capping no. right if he was capping if he was intentionally deceiving people leave it up people need to know right right. And and I and I don't know if he so much intentionally was trying to deceive people. I don't I don't know if I can say that. Oh, we don't know. We it don't, we don't know this plan. We we don't. Well, yeah, but, that's 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 in the follow up video, right? But what I feel like is we're a podcast, right? And we're not just a CHH podcast. That's number one. Like, well, we, yeah, we never intended. We never intended to be a CHH. We podcast. don't. Yeah, that that we was don't, never part of the objective. At Our all. thing has always been barbershop talk. We actually Absolutely. started in a chat room just talking and said, "Yo, why don't we just." grab our topics that we talk about and put it on a podcast and that's how Yo, and, and and also the reality is that a lot of you know just being in other chats a lot of believers are having the same conversations that we're having on this podcast they're just not having them out in the open right facts right 
And it, so it's, dudes want to act different when it's out in the public. You know what I mean? <laughs> Real so different. when we were reporting, we're like, all right, you know, I, I feel like it would be dishonest if we didn't even mention the cameo stuff. Right. That would be dishonest of us because we knew about it, right? And then it's like, it's like, it's like your man sends you a text and he goes, yo, did you see this artist? He got a shout out from the game. You know what I'm saying? And then now you tell your man, you're like, oh, word, that's dope. That's what's up. But yo, you know that you can go on Cameo and you can get a feature like that. I'm not saying that that's what, right. that's not saying, I'm not saying that that's what he did, right? right. That's, that's what you'll say probably in the text where right, you'd be like, right. you know, you could, you could pay for something like that. And they'd be like, oh, word. And then they can make a decision from there. You know what I'm saying? This is, this so that is was right. all our attention was. It wasn't to bash this is how the name, I see it. bash this, the brand right uh clout like we were we weren't nah, not clout never, chasing never like that never you know that, what I'm never saying? that never that here's the thing this I, I see it like this like if i'm rocking some fake jays and i pull up to the block and it's gonna be like yo son those are fake jays if you don't got the budget you know what i'm saying for some off whites <laughs> you could go to the outlet it cops up, you know what I'm saying, and that's all we did. We was like, "Yo, son, they look fake. They look like fake days. I don't know, but if you want to cop one, you can go to the outlet and cop some. You know, they I think what be happened, whites, but they go, they go be. I some. think what happened was the we we said the fake jays a little too loud, <laughs> <laughs> and everybody heard, overheard. Right, right, yeah. Yo, but for the record, for the record, I I, I want to clear something up because I saw a few comments. Uh, people were saying like, yo, you know, there's CHH, you know, this, it, you know, this is beef or whatever. This is not beef whatsoever. We didn't, we didn't slander this man. Yo, like, I'm going to speak for me personally. Um, I didn't grow up in the church. I didn't grow up in youth groups. You know what I mean? I grew up a little differently. You know what I mean? So I know what beef is. You know what I'm saying? Like, What's beef? Ooh, listen, Throw that beat on. listen, man. <laughs> look, look. I'm not. I'm not. Look. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not trying to act like I'm a super thug and nothing like that because I'm not. But I had the hammer in junior high. You know what I'm saying? I punch dudes in their face. I've been jumped. I stab people. I've been shot at. You know what I'm saying? I'm not a super thug, but I know what beef is. This is not that. This is not that. You know what right. I mean? So, people on Twitter and social media, stop calling it beef. You know what I mean? This is. We brothers in Christ, you know what I mean? First and foremost. Right. Regardless of our differences, you know what I'm saying? It's it's Christ gang, you know? Right. And so dead all that talk about beef because ain't the, the, there's no beef. You know what I mean? Your man was talking greasy in the video, you know? Hey, you know what I'm saying? Like, it is what it is. You know what I mean? We're going to see him. CHH community is very small. We're going to approach him and we're going we're gonna to check his temperature and see if it is what it is. You know what I mean? Because I want to know if it's beef. If it's, if it's really beef from him, I want to know. You know what I'm saying? Because I don't want to be walking around here like, like everything is lovely. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's just, that's just not how I move. You know what I mean? Like, I got a family. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Well, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't see and, and it. In I don't that think type it's, yeah, I don't, I don't see it like that. But your man was talking greasy. You know what I'm saying? And I just, I just want to point that out, you know, because. He admitted to doing everything that he said he was falsely accused of. Yeah. Right. So that means now that means that he's slandered. He's slandering us. Right. By 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 implying or having his people, you know, saying that we're hating, that we're clout chasing, that we were trying to we we yo we we help you move streams. Like what are you talking about? You know, we was never out to d destroy or 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 we we didn't even know you had a project. You know, like you, like I said, you wasn't even on our radar. You know what I'm saying? So like, it, it, we weren't trying, we weren't trying to sabotage your release or nothing like that, man. You know what I'm saying? So, I forgive you, Joey. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's it, man. You know, no, he's, slander, he's out there slandering us, but it's all good. You know, I'll say forgive us as well if you felt like we've offended you or we've done something that has, you know, what I'm saying, like. If you feel a certain type of way, then we ask for forgiveness as well. You know what I'm saying? Absolutely. Absolutely. We are not trying to get into any kind of drama with people. We rather right. talk, talk it out and, and go on about our day. You know what I mean? Because at the end of the day, the Lord is the one that judges everyone. You know right. what I'm saying? Absolutely. So depending on how we handle our situations, we know we're going to be accountable. You know what I'm saying? I don't care what Instagram says, Twitter, all those things. You know what I'm saying? I care about what the Lord feels and the people in that, that, are, that are, that we're held accountable to feels, you know what I'm saying? And accountability is, is very big because I've seen a lot of CHH artists talking greasy too. 
on Twitter. You know what I'm saying? And um, and this is before he did his video. It admitted that he paid for cameo and everything else. You know what I'm saying? He didn't pay so, for it. His wife. Said, did. Oh, his. You're right. His. Yeah. His. His wife did. Um. <laughs> so they were. They were. They were. They were. They were. They were talking greasy too on Twitter. You know what I'm saying? Like sending shots. You know. And and some could argue that it was it was just towards Jay, right? Uh, you know, the cruise hip hop corner, but in the video that, that, uh, that Joey just released, he's talking about the people who received a cease and desist letter. So as far as I know, um, it was the cruise hip hop corner, TNC and CHHTS. You know what I'm saying? So I think all three of those brands definitely deserve an apology. You know what I mean? A public apology. Wow. But only okay. one of the three were blocked from his Instagram, though. Well, yeah, y'all was y'all was going in. On the no, two, two, right? two out of three. Ah, two out of three. CHHS was was blocked too. Oh, okay, two out of three. Yeah, yeah, two out of three. Not he didn't he didn't block. Uh, was going in on the. No one was going in on the comments. Well, at least not. At least. Well, um, well. Our side. There was a comment made from from CHHTS, and it's, it says, "Wait, so this means that the Cruise Hip Hop Corner and that's not Christian weren't lying? They were right, and it wasn't slander." Well, that comment got deleted, and CHHTS was blocked shortly after that. Mm. I don't know, man. Those be Does that sound real. like like some beef or like some hating comments? I mean, I don't know. It doesn't. It doesn't sound like yeah. It's a it's a legitimate question. Right, if you admit into that your wife um, bought this for you, right? right. So then it was it on, true to begin with, right? So then what, what's what's the problem? What the problem is? Mm. So why he? I his, guess I guess people feel like why wow, just keep going on and on. Like you know, it becomes a back and forth thing through right. social media, and at sure. that point, it's just like just slide in each, in each other's DMs and be like, hey, what's going on? Like, it's like right. that man, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> you know, because it's, it's all like a public thing. And then, uh, you know, it got real, it got, it got a little messy for a while. Look, it got a little but, messy but, over the week. But here's the thing, though. Here's the thing, though, Switch. Like, if, if you're a, a public person, right, like a musician, mm -hmm. and we're a podcast, and if everything is being addressed out in the public, um, then then uh why not address it in the public you know what i'm saying like why why does it why why should he go private to be like yo my bad i'm sorry like nah address it publicly dog like you know what i'm saying like i, I don't know that's how i feel man right that that's 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 really how i feel it's like if, if you put it out there in the public you put it out there in the public space then it's uh it's free season man you know what i mean i could dig it I could dig it, you know what I'm saying? I just, and, and, and it's not even like like we're not even like dissing the dude at all. Like we've never dissed the dude. Mm -mm. Right? We never dissed him. Like like in, in, in the in the in the podcast episode, again, we never said that that's what he did because we can't prove it. You know, we can't but, prove it at all. But I will say people y'all everybody went in on their Twitter. <laughs> yeah, people were going in, bro. I, I saw I saw a lot of uh a lot of support for him publicly, like from Christians, like yo, you know, the, uh, these people are clowns, whatever, whatever. Like, <laughs> hey, okay, you know, it is what it is. Oh, you saw know? that? I, I ain't see, I ain't see much. I mean, I, I've seen that on both sides. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. I saw a couple comments like, "Oh, Joey's a goofy for that," you know. And it wasn't, it, and that's the thing. It wasn't for for that to be all that. You know what I'm saying? Right, right, right. Like, I don't even, I don't think if we got that cease and desist letter, like I'm gonna be honest, like. Well, our YouTube view for that video was like what forty views, fifty views, and it shot up all the way to like eight hundred, nine hundred views on that one video. Yeah, shout shout out to the cruise hip hop corner because uh, he uh, he shouted us out in one of his videos, and after he did that, our joint went up, our numbers went up. Um, so shout out to him for that. So it was like if the cease and desist letter, like no one would have ever really cared as much, you know? Yeah, like I said, he wasn't even he wasn't on our radar, like. I didn't find out. I didn't find out that he had a project. Like even, even when I saw when I saw the the game video, like it didn't click that he had a project coming out. Like I didn't know like it was coming out that week. You know what I'm saying? Like I had no yeah. clue. Actually, I think we dropped the video the same day that he dropped his his project. 
you know that was just a sheer coincidence i had i hadn't i had no clue you know well it was the song actually so it was it was it was an introduction for the song that he made. gotcha gotcha um gotcha. yeah and you know the convo the convo was there because it's a chh artist being co-signed by a major secular artist you know what i'm saying right. that's why the convo was even brought up or even mentioned you know what i mean so that's what that is man and um you know, I hope I pray and I hope all parties are, you know, everybody's chilling and not, you know, nobody's on some rah rah, you know what I mean? <laughs> and uh we just we just walk in integrity and in honesty and everything that we Yeah, do. Well, yeah I'm glad you said that, man, because because we we are uh we are a Christian podcast. We're Christians first, right? Right. Uh, we're a Christian podcast and our, our brand and our integrity is very important to us. So when we report, that's why we tell people to add us. Right. 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 Like every every time we say something, especially me, because because I, I say a lot of things, especially when it comes to politics. And so um, we're always telling people, yo, add us if we're wrong, add us. You know what I mean? Like tag us. You know what I mean? Let us know. And we've 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 come we've come on the show. What? Maybe twice and been like, yo, we was wrong. Right. Right. Like, like because somebody added us and was like, yo, uh, what you said about X, Y and Z was wrong or whatever, whatever. Or it might have been a little off. And we come back on the show and cleared it up. Like we're we're accountable to our words, you know. So our brand, our uh, the brand, uh, the the integrity of our brand is very important to us. You know what I'm saying? So right. Um, we take slander very seriously. You know what right. I mean? And you know that was that was also another thing where I kind of felt like, man, we could talk about any any and, and everything. Quiet. You know what I'm saying? Any and everything. Like we could talk about. Uh, BLM. We can have opinions about sports. Right. We can have opinions about anything. But it seems like when people want to have an opinion on CHH or want to report on CHH, it's like an issue. You know? What nah, I'm saying? it ain't. It ain't nah, I don't think so, man. I, I think I think I don't I don't think it's it's reporting on CHH. I think I think it's whenever you say something that is going to hold the CHH artist accountable. It's a right. problem. I can see you that. Know? That's but, where the problem is. You know? But even like the crew, like a lot of people don't like the crew, but they'll watch CNN or they'll watch CSNBC. And but it, when it comes to the crew, it's like, oh, you know, you're talking about other people and this and that. Like, no, it's just yo, what's, ain't going it funny on, what's going on in our community, in that community. You know what I'm saying? Yo, ain't it funny, though, that people who criticize the crew always call them the Christian academics. But how you know who academics is? <laughs> you know what I mean? like, <laughs> like, like, how you know who academics is? You know what I mean? Like, oh, this dude, he thinks he's Christian academics. Like, how you know that, bro? <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, stop. Right. right. Stop. Well, well, and that's another thing. It seems like people want to pull that I'm Christian card. Right. Or yeah, Christian that's another thing. That's another Bible thing. Only when it's convenient, right? When they when want it's convenient. to. You know what I'm saying? And, yeah, and that, that was something that I've always felt about with the music thing, too. Right. Like, right. Oh, I don't listen to worldly music. It doesn't edify me. But you watch Power, you watch Ozark, you watch all these movies that are out Come here, on. but yet you have an issue. You know, you pull your Christian card right away when it comes to edifying music. Oh, I only listen to Christian music, which is cool. I don't got no problem with it. But don't be coming out here pulling your Christian card on other brothers who might listen to some secular music. And I'm not saying they're right or wrong. I'm just saying... Right. In general, don't don't you know what I mean? Like take that speck out your eye before you take it out of somebody else's eye. You know what I'm saying? Let's go. And Let's even go. with this situation, I felt like some people were quoting scriptures to kind of like be, I saw that. I be, saw that. I saw I saw to I pull saw, out it, the Christian card yeah. at that moment. And it was I'm, like specifically on Twitter. Specifically on Twitter. I and saw then no, it was no like big deal talking about uh slander and 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 lying lips and this and that. This is before Joey did, admitted that he had done all those things. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. I, I haven't, I haven't seen him walk that back or clarify. I didn't, I didn't see him tweet anything about uh, holding your brothers accountable. Mm. Yeah, I mean, I didn't, I didn't see nobody mention about lawsuits about uh, that suing, too. suing people. You know what I mean? That's, yeah, that too. So you know what I mean, so uh, yeah, I, I think that the the criticism is only a problem, um, in my opinion. When, when, it, well, for those, for those, for those who have a problem with accountability, I'll say that because I talked, I talked to people from, from, from a couple of different labels, you know, in the chat, um, we in that chat where there's like 
you know, about over 100 uh, CHH artists. And um, none of those dudes have a problem with accountability and being transparent. Um, you know what I'm saying? But it seems like a lot of these dudes um, that are out there, you know what I mean, on the social media and whatnot, um, have a problem with it, you know, especially when it's something like, some like, um, like they real sensitive about about their, their their craft. Like they they want no type of criticism. You know what I'm saying? No type of criticism. Jay was talking about that. Like, why is it that if I say that your album is dope, like yo Jay, you do you know I love your show this and that and the third. But when I criticize your joint, you're like, oh man, you trash and you know you want to be Christian <laughs> academics. This and that and the third. You know what I'm saying? It's like, come on. Well, son, that's right? what I'm saying. People pull that the Christian right. card. Right. right. Exactly. Right. Exactly. It's like, well, because they're believers, we can't have any kind of opinions, opinion. right? And at the end of the day, we are CHH fans. Some of us have been CHH fans for years. Some of us years. 15, 20 years in this game have seen, you know what I mean, from cross movements to Corby Reds to right. even before that, you know what I'm saying? And, um, and you know, sometimes we have, we have our own opinions about things. We see things in that in just like an everyday individual person's life, you know what I'm saying? Like, Oh yeah, I, I, that was kind of that was kind of funny how he did that, or that was dope how he did that, or whatever. Right, you know what I'm saying? Right. And so when we come together and we pot on it, that's what our expression is going to be. It's not going to be any different. It's not going to be sugar coated because the person is a Christian or not a Christian. You know what I'm saying? Right. It's just right. how we feel at the moment, and you know we we address it. You know what I'm saying? And right, that's it. You know, it it isn't to slander or defame nobody or. You know what I mean, or or, or try to uh, be a hater. <laughs> that like, was thrown, thrown around a lot, which is which is crazy because we we weren't even like we 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 talked about that, and then we went into cam. We started talking about cameo, and then we talked about hiring someone from cameo to be on our show. You bro, know what I'm saying? I'm gonna like, tell y'all, man. Like I'm, the, the I'm show talking to my man about, right now. Yeah. Like, yo, let's get Charlemagne or let's get somebody. <laughs> right. You know what I'm saying? Right. Let's get them to give us a shout out. Like, right, right. We even talked about Fat Joe and the mixtape and everything. You know what I'm saying? Like the show, like we 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 touched on that subject and we moved on. Like the show, that episode wasn't even like about son. You know what I mean? So like then we got into that horrific, that horrific bag. That horrific bag for show. <laughs> you know, but we got a new sponsor, you know, sh- shout out to WatsonVontes.com. <laughs> hey yo, hey, you kind of quiet over there, man. What, 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 what did you think about this whole situation, bro? Corny. <laughs> <laughs> he said, "I'm sticking to my." Those are the only words he got. Just corny. Like I said before, it was corny. I thought that was. At first, I got I got upset when I saw the um, when I saw the cease and desist. Cause I'm cause I was I was really upset because like you said, like where does it say? You know that you just you hit with a lawsuit or, or right. threats first. So I got upset about that because I'm really thinking where where did we defame this dude? What did we right. say wrong? Right. We said right. nothing wrong. We said what we thought might have happened. You know what I'm saying? That was all all opinion on our side. So where where was this uh, uh, defamation of character coming in? You know what I mean? I mean, and even when I said it was corny. Right. Um, I said paying for a shout out that's not genuine is corny. You know what I'm saying? Like you could take that three hundred and go I don't know, go buy yourself a new hoodie for your video outfit or something. <laughs> some you know off white. I mean? Yeah, you know, go run some ads on your single. Um, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, no, yeah, you're right, cause uh, uh Switch was talking about that as well too. He was like run some ads, yep. Yeah, um well, you know, know, at the end of the day, it worked, right? I mean, yeah, it, it did. It got, it got, it got, it got the traction that he needed. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I mean, it did, it did. But I still, I still felt like that was corny. Like the approach, you know, like he, he, he tried to pull a fifty cent on behalf of us. You know what I'm saying? With the threats, and that's that's corny for me. I mean. I think I got triggered, actually. You know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> I was like, "Yo, this dude serious?" Like, <laughs> you, you, you were, you were ready to take it back to East New York, huh? Right. I was like, <laughs> "Is he serious?" Because, like, come, like, talk to me. I don't even know you. You know what I mean? Right. I, right. And and I, me, out of all people, like, you know, you C H H. Um, 
I and, and you're not even popular. I definitely don't know you. So, right. Um, you know, to do all of that, I had no problem. We could talk. Um, you know, you could DM me. I DM you. But the minute I I, I even commented on his um. Oh, that's right. Because you went, you went and, and commented on the joint, right? I commented on, on, so he came with his video, and in his video mentioned, you know, oh, if you got a see, but that's the thing that th- this is what got me upset, right? Because I mean, the cease and desist, yeah, I was bothered by it. I was only bothered because I was trying to figure out where we defamed it, right? When we, I thought, we, I, I, I thought, I thought the 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 letter was a joke from the beginning. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. I, you know what? Okay, I didn't think it was a joke until I replied and said, where, you know, where, where was this? Where, where did we defame? Where did we do say anything about that, right. that you know, that was wrong? Right. And, that was another thing, because Ant did a pr- reply and ask, well, where, where did exactly did we say that that was, you know, slander or right. like, even his name? And then he came back with another threat. You guys keep talking. Basically, this is, I'm paraphrasing, but if you guys keep talking, further legal action this is being recorded in the fir- and will be used against you you know what i'm saying so right. they, were, they said so, plenty of negative comments were said right. about him so so again and i didn't mention this in the in, and we don't know if that's him or not we we, we his don't team. it's someone from his team obviously well he but, said he don't have a team right right so let me get to that okay so we was in the chat right and there was a lot of a lot of there was few there was there was a good amount of people that backed us right that said and then agree with us but someone did mention um oh what if if it was a uh, um if it was a joke you know what i'm saying oh, like and then we kind of took it to another level or whatever the case right but see I, and i never i never had the chance but i didn't i didn't tell in the chat that he came back with a reply with further threats and this wasn't maybe like a couple minutes i mean not a couple minutes but maybe like an hour or two after but it was definitely a couple of minutes after my reply. Yeah. Where he came back with further threats. You know what I'm saying? Or he, she, whoever it was, came back with further threats, threatening legal action, and that's it's being recorded. So to me, at that point, I knew it wasn't a joke. You know what I'm saying? They were taking it serious. Now, as far as how serious, as far as going to court and all of that, I don't know. But the fact that they felt like they were serious, you know what I'm saying? I, I took it that they was being serious and they was trying to punk us in a way. Right. So, you know what I'm saying? So that's what got me upset. Then he puts out the video and then says he doesn't have a legal team. But then the end of video and say, oh, you've been warned. And the next one is not going to be so nice. To me, that's all threats. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, but that's what I was talking about is 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 that um, it's not beef. But I also don't take threats lightly. You know what I'm saying? Because I come from a different world. You know what I'm saying? And so that's why, like, I don't think it's beef. But I definitely want to check your man's temperature, you know, when I see him at the next event, you know, to see what it is. Because if it's not going to if it's not going to if it's going to be worse or whatever he said than what it was before and before it was just a cease and desist, it was legal action. Then what's worse right. than legal action? Right. You know what I'm saying? So. I'm like, yo, son, like, you know, so, what are we talk what are we talking about here? You know? Right. So, and then after that, you know, everybody's like, well, or I guess the same person that said, you know, it was a joke, blah, blah, blah or could have been a joke. And he never specifically mentioned y'all. Well, we already know it was three people that got uh cease and desist, right? Right, right. Not three people, but three different uh entities. Three different and, brands, right. Right, three different brands got these uh, cease and desist, but only one was blocked. Well, excuse me, CHHTS was blocked, but I was the first to get blocked. Right, right. <laughs> All you, I you, made it. Your whole, no, no, you personally were blocked. Personally, right? I was blocked. Right. You know what I'm saying? Right. And I didn't say anything. All I did was reply to another person. I replied to another person that was making comments. And all I said was, where was he defamed? Like, where did we slander this? Which is a legitimate question. Which is a legitimate yeah. question. Because we, we we didn't take our video down, and that's one of the reasons why I argued to leave it up was because it's like, nah, let let the record show. You know what I mean? So like, yeah. if anybody feels that that it, including Joey, you know what I'm saying? And matter of fact, Joey, yeah, you know I mean, since 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 uh, your team is is watching. Listen, man, feel free to come on the show and we could we could hash this out, man, publicly. You know, let people know that this isn't CHH beef. You know what I mean? 
Obviously, they watch it. Let's straighten out the record. Right. Well, that's what I'm saying. Go back, go back to that episode, episode 52, you know, and point out at what point did we defame or did, did we slander? Because you're not right. going to find it. So I made a comment. I said we, there was no lying. We never lied. We, f- we stated what we felt. Never lied on him. And I asked the person, did you actually watch the video? That's what I said. Right. And I got blocked. <laughs> right. Right. <laughs> right. Cause that's, that's another thing, you know, um, comments were made from two different YouTube channels. You know what I'm saying? So we may have said something and the crew may have said something, but it may not have been the same things that we were saying. You know what I'm saying? It may have been similar. It didn't matter. It was all true. Y'all. Yo, but, <laughs> but, but, it's like you get lumped in in that group, like oh right, yeah, right. y'all. Did, you know what I'm saying? Like it's like. But to me, to me, he still went like, all right. He if, if that was the case, he never blocked crew. Matter of fact, he was interacting with them. Yeah, he did. He actually replied to his comments. Yeah, right. So what he yeah. said because the video was genius, which I I actually thought the the video was hilarious. Honestly, I, knew. I was laughing. I was like, oh, that's a good flip. And then he got the cameo page for y'all that don't know. Because yeah. we're going to report honestly. Like, he got a cameo page and he's like, right, right. for limited time only, you can get it for one ninety nine. dollars <laughs> And we were ready to get him that cameo. What's up, man? Let's get it. Let's get Joey on a cameo real quick, man. <laughs> I ain't paying that dude. But um, he trying to recoup for that game feature. Right. <laughs> but, <laughs> well, he ain't paying for it. He, uh-huh. It was a gift. It was a gift. Man, they all in the same house, yo. Right. <laughs> my wife Joey's spends it. House, right. right. My wife spends it. I spent it. Come on, stop it. But yo, I was looking for stuff for my wife when I seen that. I was like, yo, maybe my wife. My wife loves John Leguizamo. So you, you know gonna pay saying? for a shout out from John? Yeah, Leguizamo? I would have paid like for a birthday. Hey, you know what I'm saying? Yo, like, you know, I, I would have done that. I did. No, excuse me. Wait, let me clear this up. I didn't pay anybody, right? I nah, pay. you paid. Why you can't pay nobody? I, and I ain't pay nobody. <laughs> my, my wife has. She had a show she watched, Queen Sugar. It was um, it's on Oprah's network, right? And it's it's a dude. It's it's a couple of people on there. Uh, they're actors. They're known actors. Um, Dondre Whitfield, uh, Kofi. I can't remember his last name. But they're they're known actors, and they've been, and the show was really popular. So I got them to uh, wish her a happy birthday. Um, individually, I said, I, you know, I sent wow. a video. I and I did not pay for it, no cameo, nothing, none of that stuff. Well, you so got I, it for free ninety nine. That's what's I got up, a, man. Yeah, I have a friend who actually uh, a, a really good friend at work. She at the time she was a marketing director for OWN Network. So she's always traveling at okay. um, press events. Yo, with let's, the shows. let's hold on, hold on, hold on. Let man, we need to get this this Oprah <laughs> plug so we can get the podcast on the Oprah network. Yeah, though. she's not, she's not, she's not at own anymore. But she's with uh, uh, what's the what's the other one? The Grey's Anatomy. Um, ABC. No, 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 no. The the writer Shonda. Uh, uh Shonda. Um, okay. Shonda Rhimes. Excuse me. Mm-hmm. So now she's at Shonda Land, right? But. I told her about how my wife was like Queen Sugar and everything, and she went and she got each one of them, and she did a personalized video, and was like, "Yo, you know, this is my friend's wife's birthday." Boom, they all, um, and she's in, she's in LA, right? So she's texting me like midnight, like, "Yo, did you get it? Did you get it? Like, answer me, you know, say because she right. had, she was sending them like individually and making sure that I got the videos because she wanted to make sure that they came out right." In right. case she had to, pre- you know, re-record or anything. Right, right. But you know, what I'm saying something like that. They don't know my wife, right? Right. But they know that I was a friend of someone that they consider a friend. You right. know what I'm saying? So they did it out of love. So I felt, I felt cool putting that up. Now this whole game thing that we don't ain't no six degrees of separation, and you had to come out of pocket. I ain't doing that. So I just said all of that because I ain't paying Joey nothing. <laughs> <laughs> but um, um look, but man, yeah. I, I, like I said, I ain't got no I, I don't have no issue with cameo, you know what I mean? Like I said in the last um podcast, not like I ain't mad at it. Like it is, you know what I mean? I'm an artist, so I understand like 
this whole rap game, in a sense, you have to kind of pay to play. You know what I'm saying? Like, you either got to pay a feature, pay for your video, pay for your production, pay for your marketing. Yeah, for sure, for sure. You know what I'm saying? And sometimes you got to, um, you got to kind of like, you know, people, you know, they fake it till they make it or whatever, or they... Yeah, see, you know I don't saying? believe they in do, fake it till you make do, it, though, man. But some people do, you know what I mean? Yeah. Some people do it that way, and that's, and that's you know, that's part of, like, the game, you know what I'm saying? Like, Drake, when he wanted, um... No pun intended. You know, he paid, what, uh, Dr- uh, what's his name, Trey Songs to get on the song, you know what I mean? And they paid for the video and all that. He spent a couple couple grand on that. Uh, supposedly, Migo spent, like, five, uh, 7000 you know what I'm saying, to get on kind of thing. Yeah, but you're gonna pay artists. You're gonna pay artists for features, right? Yeah, because yeah, you pay. I don't them, mean right? you know them like that. You know what I mean? Like you just pay for them. You know, that's just it's a fee. All right, but my thing is like, how many artists get on a track and don't know each other? You know what I'm saying? Oh, that's what I'm like, saying. A lot of people do that. Like, we, yeah. but you paying them, right? You paying them for the for the. So you pay them for the for the appearance, right? To get on the track, you pay them for their work. Right to make your song or make your song dope or whatever, but then that's at that point it's up to you to um to promote it, right? Right. But I mean, I don't know. I guess I don't know these guys. They just it's a shout out. Like, yo, check my man out. I mean, yeah. I guess. I, I mean, guess I just my same. thing is I don't see it, I don't see that no different. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, I guess you're because right. it's 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 still marketing. You know what I mean? Like to his fans and people that weren't probably aware cameo you know what i'm saying even though it's a public thing like they were like oh do, you're doing big things you're doing your thing you know what i'm saying like they didn't know <laughs> right so let me say this like how but so this is where i get confused right like how is your fans and the game fans the same yeah mm-hmm. that's interesting but he's from uh he's out from cali right or oh, he lives in cali. i mean i get it right but yeah yeah audiences should be different no well, the music style is is very different, in my opinion. What about the content? Forget the, the style. content. Yeah, yeah, yes. you're bugging because if if it would have been Griselda, I would have been all over it. See, <laughs> it what if it was Benny? If it was Griselda, <laughs> if it was Benny or Conway, right? He would he want Benny or Conway to um to. He gonna be on the podcast, man. We gonna we gonna pay for a shout and out that, for Benny. And, and that's another thing. Like there's there's just some there's some chh fans that just. They ain't feeling the video at all just because it's the game and he's a secular artist and he cussed and they just on some, nah, I ain't rocking with that. You know what I'm saying? They on some, that's not Christian. Yeah. 